Hello everybody, welcome back to another tutorial. Today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to add Christmas 2023 to your Gorilla Tech copy. Sorry, what I meant by that is how to make your own Gorilla Tech copy in Christmas 2023. But before we get into it, I just wanted to say that if we hit 5,000 subscribers by the end of the year, I'm going to get a buzz cut and I have quite a lot of hair. I have a middle part right now, so yeah, get me to 5,000 subscribers and I will get a buzz cut. Anyways, let's get into the video. Okay, so first things first, what you want to do is you want to go into the description down below and go into my Discord. Then you want to scroll down to Crema 2023, and then you want to download the drive right here. It should say it can't scan for viruses. It's not a virus, it's just 4.9 gigabytes because it's a newer update. You just want to click download anyway. So once you have this downloaded, you need to have one more. I'll leave that in the description as well. But once you have this downloaded, what you want to do is you want to open the file location by clicking this folder right here. And then what you want to do is you want to right click it and then click WinRAR and then click Extract to Xmas 23. And then let this extract and you should be done. So once it's done exporting, what you want to do is you want to open your Unity. Then once your Unity has opened, what you want to do is you want to click Add, Add Project from Disk. Go to your E drive or whatever drive you have that you have your Xmas 23 in. Double click it, double click it again, 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 until you see Xmas 23. It's a few, it's a few files, I don't know why, so many, but all of these files until you get to like assets, library, logs, all of that, and then click add project. You, knew, you do need 2021.3.33F1. If you don't, you want to click on it and then just install it and then click open. So once you load in, it should be all bright like this. What you wanna do is you wanna to go to edit, project settings, oh no, preference, oopsie. Don't open preference. Go to edit, go to project settings, go to quality, or not quality, go to player, player right here. And then make sure you're on Android, go down to other settings, scroll down to normal quality and put it to low quality. Sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't. Uh, if it doesn't, you can just make all the materials lower, but for me, I don't really care about it because it's just a tutorial. So I'm not gonna be changing anything right now. Okay, so once you open it, it didn't work for me, so what you can do is you can click on here, go down to the material, click select material, highlight both of them, and then change this down a little bit so it's not as blinding and do that for like every material or you can just keep it the same now to actually set up servers what you want to do is you want to go here to playfab authenticator just like so <coughs> you want to right click this and then click edit script uh, but i do not think this unity version has um okay be right back Okay, so if you don't have the C Sharp script, whatever thing, the uh, Microsoft Visual Studio installed, what you can do is you can type in photon server and then go onto the first one and it should go with your app ID, pun, and voice. Pun is just your normal real time app ID and voice is your just normal voice. You don't want to do chat though because chat is a little weird. And then you want to go to Playfab Shared, the first one, and then put your title ID here. I'm going to do that real quick, and then we'll see what it works. So here, what you want to do for your Playfab, you want to grab your four, five letters and numbers, and then you just want to paste it in here. And then for your Photon server, you want to go here, down to add-ons. <laughs> oh my add-ons, photon, and then you want to grab your real-time app ID, paste it in the pun, and then grab your chat app ID, and paste it in here. For app version, you don't want to do anything, and for fixed region, you want to do EU, or wherever you're staying. So for me, I'm in uh, Europe, so I'm going to do it EU. If you're in US, you do US or US, and if you're in US West, you just do USW. As you can see, once playing, this is now green. So we can go over here to tutorial. 
Actually, where is the gorilla? Oh, he's right here. Awesome. So you can just do gorilla player then. Go here. Drag him over. But yeah, now as we are playing, as you can see, all the boards are green. You can change the message of the day. Servers completely work. It's a great project. Thank you so much to Horizon for sending me this again. Um, Horizon, great dude. You should, y'all should go make a, or send him a friend request. Uh, but yeah, thank you all f so much for watching this tutorial. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next tutorial. Bye-bye.